Question. You know, only the best uh, versus fightings. Uh, uh, the mix-up. When these two step on stage against each other at CEO, I think 2022, uh, whenever these two step up against each other, it is always a banger. But here's the thing. Joker normally goes for the Hiachi against Super Kuma, but I'd speaking to him quite a lot and he said, you know what? I think I might be going all Feng. Okay. It might be all Feng. And there it is straight for the Feng right now. He's, he said, I think I know what I need to do to, to win with the Feng. Because normally he liked Teihachi versus Akuma so much. He he wasn't as versed with the Feng. But I think the training pack's done as well. They have some of the best Akuma players in the world. He said, you know what? I think uh... I know what I need to do with Feng now to win this matchup. Gone for it immediately. But Super Kuma, again, this is a character he's going to have so much well, experience well. against. I mean, for the both of them. Fight. All right, we're going to go right into it. Who is going to take the lead early on here? Nice. QCF 1 plus 2 gets the head, but count hit there for Joker. I know QCF1 beats the focus. Great work there from Joker. Clean moves back. Shoulder simple combo takes the damage. Nice. Oh, the down forward one able to beat out that. Oh, Ooh. and the counter hit. Closing it out. Nice. There it is. Down four, one plus two finishes it. And the stomp for good measure. First round of Joker. Super Akuma, how are you going to adjust here? Down four, back four. Very simple Feng gameplay right now for Joker. I want to punish that while sending one to. And then you're not going to see Joker do too much after while sending one to one hit because it's only plus one. <laughs> but, on, but on block is a different situation. Correct. And now he's making quite the use of that attack. Mm. This time into the hop kick, closing it out with another round. Two rounds straight. Kick. You know what Joker calls that when he does? He says knee mode. He says, knee mode. He says I'm in knee mode now. <laughs> so, I, I think Joker's activated knee mode. The power of the reeds. But for Super Akuma. And again, very simple Feng gameplay, but nice. He actually tried to punch Sabaki, but the timing of the back two messed it up. Very nice work there from Super Akuma. Carries Joker into the corner. Yeah, and this is where it gets scary because not only does he have the spacing by the wall, he has the meter. Oh, the hard duck there from Joker. Tries. He should be dead. No, he's not. Oh, he could have used the meter, but he didn't. Down back three. Got to be careful. Nice. Simple mid kick. Super Kuma staying alive. Standing attack there. The follow up here. Super Kuma still has meter. Air fireball as the approach. Again, keeps you very simple this time. About 10 seconds gone. Just a tiny lick of damage on both sides. Can barely notice it. Looking for a way to get in right now. Super Kuma has his work cut out for him. And Joker with Ooh. the lead with the jump over. Wow. wow. And he still got the float. Again, he, he does look very prepared for this matchup, I have to say. Here before takes the max damage. Back turn throw. Pure mix up. What are you going to do here, Super Kuma? Whoa. No. 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 Flag on the play. That should not happen. But it ended up working out. Joker. <laughs> As planned, I guess. As planned. Taking a nice, he's just taking a sip there. He's like, yeah, this is, that's exactly what I knew would happen there. Super Kuma looking around, he's like, okay, that, yeah, he's, he's struck the shoulders. Like, okay. You know, not much you can really do against that. The yellow M&Ms, he's brandishing There them. it is. There the it peanuts. is. <laughs> <laughs> he's ready to go now, man. He, he's had his favorite snack. He can't, he can't be stopped. He can't be stopped. He's had his favorite snack. Someone get someone get Super Kuma some Prince Biscuits. See, that's the problem is no one knows what that is. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to go into this particular matchup here. Super Akuma, I'm not going to count him out. Cannot. You, you never can. But uh, yeah, no surprises. How would this state? Oh, this is a stage of violence. Mm. I mean, that's exactly what I expect as well when these two step to the stage. Fight. All right, starting things off here. Nice approach right now. Good sidestep from Joker early on, but a big block here from Super Akuma. He's going to get the damage. Not only that, the most important thing, he's building that meter as he pushes yeah. towards the wall. And again, he's slowly pushing Joker to right into the corner as well. Not what you want to be against this character. All characters. Cassie's Ooh. walking. Nice. Oh, that's unfortunate for him there, but a big block Ooh. once again. He's going to close it out. There yeah. it is. Two big low reads there from Super Akuma. Just win him the round. Sidestep four in the back turn down three. I mean, Joker taking some risks didn't work out, but... That's going to be in Super Kuma's head for the rest of this set. Oh, yeah. Big chance, big opportunity here. This time, opting to go ahead and cancel out the focus attack early. Doesn't want to get clipped like he did in the opening game. Number two gets nothing. Ooh. Oh, neutral hop kick. Some shenanigans there. They should go to the wall as well. Is he going to break it? No, he's not going to keep it. But he has the positioning here. Great. Wow. Oh, my God. EX DP counter hit. Could have been a waste of meter, I think, because Joker's just going to take this round. It might have, yeah, I was going to say, it pretty much feels like a waste right there. Mm. But sometimes you got to let him know that the disrespect is not coming yeah. today. But again, with one round up, you know, he still has time to build meter, so. Okay. Calculated risk. 
10 seconds gone. Oh, the air fireball. I think he's trying to catch him out of the air with the forward forward. Did not work out, though. Right now, Super Kubo with a nice life lead, a big counter hit. And that's the thing. He has to be very careful how he uses that attack as well. It is very easy to whip punish it. But right now, he's making things work. Oh, he caught, oh, caught nice. Ducky. Run up into the down 4-3. Has rage, so he's doing extra damage right now. Keeps the combo simple as well. Ooh, and nice block again. there. Super Kuma loves Ducky on Wake Up. And Joker's really paying it for right now. It's been all big low reads that have got Super Kuma these rounds. Yeah, and it wasn't really worth it for go to, to go for that 1 plus 4 in that particular yeah. situation. But again, it really shows that Super Kuma locked wow. and loaded, ready to go. Big damage here with the EX Tatsu. He has the wall. What's the mix? What you got? Any added enough meter? Big damage. And look at the meter yeah. as well. He can close it out. He touches him one more time. Now oh, one, he two, caught and him. The, touch. the that, trap. That was the touch right there, Mark. And now one game apiece between these two. Super good, but definitely. Like, I think that first game, he did look a bit flat. But that he, game, he woke he up. really came alive. And I think we saw the character select from Joker. Oh, so he's uh, thinking about his old old buddy here? So, Or does he just want a breather? So obviously we have we have life giving him some words of encouragement right now. I mean these two, very good friends, very good training partners, Joe goes to Saudi Arabia all the time. They learn a lot from each other. But now definitely he's, he might be thinking about the Hey Hachi. And now here's the thing. It's a it's a decision to me where I feel like you can go to it if you've been playing the character, you've been practicing the character. Yeah, but has he? When I've been speaking to Joke about this event, he's been saying, I think it's all Feng. I think it's Feng all the way. You know? I said to him as well, what if you play Super He said, I think it's still the Feng. So I think he's just taking some time to think right now. He's made a decision. I think he's going to stick to it. He's still hovering the thing. Maybe he needs to pick a new outfit. Sometimes that's all it is, because yeah. sometimes a new outfit is a completely different you know? character. So we're just giving us a look right now. Yeah, lo lots of time to think. Because again, this is important. You never want to lose your first game when it comes to a round robin. Like, yes, it's a round robin. You have lots of games to play, but losing that first game can really set the tone for the rest of your tournament. Yeah, having and that different levels of pressure on you too, where mm. if you don't get the win that you yeah. want initially, you have to try extra hard for yeah. every single one after that. And it's interesting as well, because go back to last year, Joker's first game in the Tecmo Tour Finals was against Life. Against his training fund, <laughs> against the guy coaching him, you know, right there. So it's like a bit of a parallel right now, you know. For at first, he's hurting you, but then he's helping you. I think Joker just picked the infinite yeah, stage there. The and again, first of two action between these two. Normally when these two play, it's a first of three. So longer set, sometimes with a reset included. But this time, only a first of two. Not that much time, but it's now the infinite azure. All right, all right. Open stage now for these two. Mm -hmm. Do you think this plays off to an advantage for either particular uh, player. For the characters, obviously, it yeah. really nullifies a lot of Akuma. But for Supercom, he's, 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 he loves not, this, he's not right? bothered by it. Because so many people pick the infinite against him anyway that he's just learned to adapt to and he plays it. He plays to it well now. Yeah, I mean, Akuma is one of those characters that he's going to get his damage no matter what. Yeah. If he has that meter and he lands that hit, that's all he needs. That's all he needs. Now, quarter of the round gone. Life lead for Joker. No meter for Supercom yet. Joker's optimal scenario is to close out this round without him letting build any meter. Oh, nice mini sidestep there. Now oh, he's caught forward, him. Forward, but drops the combo, but a stomp is still enough. Yeah. Still nice damage. And look at that, the way that Joker just kind of out of length, uh, arms length here. Not trying to get into the, the, the danger zone, right? Yeah. Ooh, nice thing. Oh, Ooh, wow, that was sick. Teleports away. The running through doesn't catch him as well. Down two jumps over. Wow, setting one, two. Nice work there from Joker. Takes the first round in the final game between these two. Oh, yeah, the layers going into this. It's like an onion. Oh, there it is. Down three, Ado. Big combo now for Super Kuma. And on Infinite Stage, he likes to end combos with a fireball or a Tatsu to follow up for something like a running three. Yeah, and then force a mix up maybe afterwards. Mm. But Joker, obviously, very active on Wake Up here. Yeah. Not going to fall for any of those shenanigans. Nice, nice. anyone keeping it simple. There's the headbutt into down two. Oh, four, four out of the air, but can't get the pickup, unfortunately. He tried. Let's see what he does here. Nice dash there with the down four three. Nice punish, not scared of the last hit of that string. Oh, forcing the mix up, but a great block there from Joker. Mm. And the punish two, one, one. Forward, forward, forward. This is looking good for Super Akuma. Both have rage. 18 seconds left to go. Rage drive spent. Big whiff, no punish. Down forward, four. 13 seconds. Down wow. forward, one, one. Super Akuma keeping this one very safe. One round apiece. Man, this is going the distance between these two. And again, both of these players picking their shots out. Super Akuma opting for more of the lows here. Trying to throw off the timing here from Joka. 
Okay, but down two. Again, we've seen that exact same pattern from Joker a lot. Nice block, but no, that's not the punish. No challenge either. Yep. Oh, just out four. of range. Yeah, looking for it. Oh, standing one, down back three. Again, a lot of a lot of poke into low. That's what we're seeing from Joker. Then there's a low poke. Nice big chunk there. In the rage, that Wasani 4 does so much damage. Mm. Oh, out of range. Nice back dash there from Joker. You see a one. Oh! oh. He, he didn't press. Oh, and he oh, finishes the last impressive. hit. Doesn't duck the second Wow! Oh, the second hit. Wow! The rage drive beating out the DP Joker. Now on set point. I feel like it was only because it was a rage drive version there yeah. that might have won. But look at that. Joker in the lead here. Super Kuma. Close to another meter here. He said, like that down for the range. Nice back Kemper. Regular throw not broken by Super Kuma. Is that an opening for Joker? Oh, oh that could have hurt. That could have been an opening for Super Kuma. He had it. Oh, he oh. had another chance there. Now his life is just gone. No punishment. Oh, he's done. Wow. The big launch, really? QCF2 catching him out of the air. But again, all handshakes, all love between those two.